got off easy compared to what was happening in other parts of the country. There was just a torrential rainstorm across the central part of the country. You can still see the elongated trough is in effect there. There was a lot of uh, flooding problems in southern Manitoba, southern Saskatchewan. The rain continues to funnel in. Uh, it looks like shower activity is beginning to peter out somewhat in sections of Alberta, but a chance of thunder showers does remain. And we have this enormous double barreled high pressure system here building over much of the province. It's going to hang on for a number of days this week. I think it's here almost all week long. So really the, the uh, most severe weather is over the central part of the country with a chance now of some thunderstorms along that trailing cold front sliding towards parts of southern Ontario where it was just a beautiful sunny weekend in much of Toronto. Today the sun comes mixed with extra clouds and a risk of thunderstorms in Toronto and Ottawa, Montreal and Quebec City. Some of that to unstable air mass uh, sliding over parts of the Maritimes in about 12 hours time as well. But the heavier rain still over the central part of the country. The rainfall warning remains in effect in Regina where it's only going to be 16 degrees. Lots of downpours for Winnipeg. Look at the change in Churchill. Churchill was 30 degrees at the end of last week and now it's 6 degrees in the downpours. And of course across much of Alberta a small chance of a passing thunder shower. Looks like the worst of your weather has passed on by. So for the west coast we're in good shape. It's going to get better for the next, uh, next several days. Beginning with sun today 22 by the water 25 inland and as the high pressure builds inland tonight and begins to create that offshore breeze it's going to warm up even more more so 25 by the coast for the holiday 30 degrees inland tomorrow and quite nice Wednesday Thursday and Friday some marine air will bring us clouds in the mornings and they burn off for sun in the afternoons I don't see much in the way of rainfall this week small chance on Thursday with the extra clouds but that's a bit of a hedge really looks pretty good for several days